सदाशिवसंभा शंकराचार्य मध्यमाचार्यपर्यता वंदे गुरुपरंपरा ओ नैष्कर्म्य सिद्धि थर्ड चैप्टर पेज नाइंटी नाइन वर्ष ट्वेल्व बोधृता कर्तृता बुद्धे कर्मता सदह तयोक्यम यथा बुद्ध पूर्वोरवनी वी आर सींग ए वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट portion of mahavakya vichara in the form of lakshya lakshana sambandhah sureshwara acharya coming to the third level of presentation of mahavakya after samana adhikaranya presentation विशेष्य विशेषण लेवल ऑफ प्रेजेंटेशन एंड द थर्ड इज लक्ष्य लक्षण संबंध प्राइमरी मीनिंग एंड सेकेंडरी मीनिंग ऑफ तम पद प्राइमरी मीनिंग इज नोन एज वाच्या secondary meaning is known as lakshyarthah primary meaning vachartha about aham that is i the individual secondary meaning lakshyartha about i the individual there is a difference what is that difference वाच्यार्थ ऐ ईज एन एंपिकल ऐ अहंकार ऐ द लोअर ऐ मिथ्या ऐ दट ईज फॉर ट्रांसक्षनल पर्पसेस इफ दिस् क्लारीटी ईज देर इन ए स्टूडेंट्स मैंड देर ईज नो saro at all insecurity at all there is no depression suppression oppression at all all are happening in the anatma mind body complex that is lower i vachartha i is the lakshanam to show the lakshyam vat लक्ष्यार्थ ऐ दट ईज वै लक्ष्यार्थ ऐ अहम एम द ट्रूथ ऑफ दिस् एंटर् यूनिवर्स साक्षी चैतन्य अहम ब्रह्म अस्म कैन बी रिवील बै दि वाच्यार्थ ऐ वाच्यार्थ ऐ हेल्प लाइक ए रिफ्लेक्टेड मेस् इन द मिर् reflected face in the mirror helps to see the original face similarly just as you cannot see the original face your own beautiful face everyone's face is beautiful for oneself okay everyone's original face is beautiful for oneself even though they cannot see their face how they can see who will reveal that original face reflected face in the mirror alone reveals the original face i hope you have done sufficient contemplation on this example i asked you to sit in front of the mirror and do this analysis vedanta is very very simple if you do this if you have done this in this uh, 15 days gap <laughs> you might have done it i know that you all have done it 
So therefore, this empirical consciousness is a vritti jnanam changing in the form of vritti jnanam, bodhruta. That bodhruta is the changing vritti jnanam, tree knowledge, book knowledge, pen knowledge. So many knowledge you get in the mind. Therefore, this uh, tree knowledge, book knowledge, etc. That's why scientists uh, analyze on this uh, vritti jnanam consciousness. They are analyzing the empirical consciousness, taking that empirical consciousness as real consciousness. They do not know it is empirical because we have absolute consciousness through the Shastra study we understand, we have absolute consciousness. We have, we are the absolute consciousness. Since scientists do not know this, they take that empirical consciousness, knowerhood. That knowerhood is a transactional changing consciousness and it has got Kartruta and Vodhruta. Kartruta means um, changing doerhood, changing knowerhood, changing selfhood. All these are there, these two are the attributes of the mind. Two are attributes of the mind. Buddhehe means mind. Buddhehe, 12th verse, we were seeing in the last class, Kartruta is changing doerhood. Kartruta means knowerhood also. I am the knower. He is called Kartruta. I am the knower. Knowing action, I am doing. Lower I. Lower I. The empirical selfhood is uh, the property of the mind, then says karmata ahantaya syat, ahantaya karmata syat. This uh, lower I, the changing I, empirical selfhood of the mind, mind has got two properties, uh, selfhood and uh, knowerhood, consciousness, cognizing power. Cognizing power is nothing but being the object of uh, the word I. Object of the word I. Ahantaya karmatasyat. I told you already, this mind is having the subjecthood and objecthood. When it is seeing the world, mind is the subject. World is the object. As it is seeing the world, it is having kartruta and bhoktruta. Who is having kartruta, bhoktruta? Mind. Mind has got uh, knowerhood and selfhood, consciousness and selfhood. Bodhruta means consciousness. Kartruta means selfhood, I am doing, I am the doer. That type of thought, bhavati, therefore it has got karmata syad, ahantaya. So, Mind is nothing uh, being the object of the word I in empirical interaction. Karmata means uh, um, it is an object to the Sakshi Chaitanya. So mind has got two statuses, subject status and object status. Subject status and object status. So, ahantaya means as the meaning of the word I. As the meaning of the word I. So, karmata syad. 
it has an object status ego status ego so uh, sakshi chaitanyam is the ever the seer ever the subject and ever the object world is ever the object never the subject remember these two words world is never the subject ever the object and atma chaitanyam is ever the subject and never the object mind happens to be the subject in jagrat avastha and object in the sushupti avastha therefore tayoho aikyam both these attributes of the mind empirical consciousness empirical uh, selfhood that is uh, i am i am that selfhood mudrata and uh, kartruta both of them are vyavaharikam vyavaharika mudrata vyavaharika pratyakta previous shloka we have used pratyakta means selfhood because of that selfhood only kartruta comes i am the doer both of them are non separate aikyam aikyam means both are non separate attributes of the mind they cannot exist separately so of the mind purva yoho aikyam atmani this word i was explaining in the last class here paramarthika bodhruta paramarthik pratyakta non separate of that atma so paramarthika absolute selfhood absolute knower absolute consciousness no bodhruta means consciousness so paramarthika bodhruta the absolute consciousness paramarthika pratyakta the absolute selfhood selfhood the pratyakta means interiorness i told you that is absolute from the standpoint of atmani in the atma eva aikyam bhavati so purva yoho means atma is consciousness consciousness is atma aikyam bhavati but mind and mind and consciousness changing consciousness cannot be aikyam mind is the substance consciousness changing consciousness or empirical consciousness or bodhruta or vyavaharika bodhruta of the mind is the property of the mind that we are going to see in the next verse whereas in you have to remember these two four steps vyavaharika and paramarthika vyavaharika empirical angle two points bodhruta and pratyakta bodhruta means consciousness kartru then pratyakta means selfhood that selfhood that interiorness what i said is called selfhood and that selfhood and um, uh, consciousness at empirical angle that is uh, mind is the substance both of them are properties they are called vyavaharika pratyakta vyavaharika bodhruta this is one group empirical angle that is at ego level ahankara level lower eye level or vachyartha level then what is the second group absolute bodhruta absolute pratyakta what it means absolute bodhruta atma has got absolute consciousness absolute consciousness bodhruta means consciousness 
Atma is consciousness, consciousness is Atma. As though Atma has got Bodhruta, Atma has got uh, Pratyakta, Selfhood. What type of Bodhruta, what type of Pratyakta, or what type of uh, Selfhood, what type of uh, Consciousness? Atma has got Absolute Consciousness, Absolute uh, Selfhood. Non-changing, avyavicharasvarupam. Whereas empirical level, mind has got vivicharasvarupa bodhruta and pratyakta. Changing, jagrat avastha and sikshupti avastha, it will change. Whereas atma bodhruta pratyakta, Absolute Bodhruta, Absolute Pratyakta, Paramarthika Bodhruta, Paramarthika Pratyakta, or Absolute Consciousness, Absolute Selfhood, or Avyabhijarasvarupam, Non-Changing. Therefore, they are the parents. What we are? Tayoho, Purvayoho. Purva yoho evam atmani. So this uh, Vyavaharika Bodhruta, Vyavaharika Kartruta. Who are their parents? Paramarthika Bodhruta, Paramarthika Pratyakta. Their parents are Absolute Consciousness, Absolute Selfhood. Atmani. In the Atma, Aikyam Bhavati. Non-separate, non-separate means Atma is Consciousness, Consciousness is Atma, Knowerhood understood as Consciousness, Bodhruta means Knowerhood, Knowerhood is equal to Consciousness, therefore to Empirical, to Absolute. To Empirical means Consciousness and Selfhood of mind are empirical. Consciousness and selfhood of Atma are absolute, paramarthika. Highly technical but very, very important. So real I, absolute bodhruta, pratyakta of Atma, they are um, Absolute Asamsari. Vyavaharika Pratyakta, Vyavaharika Bodhruta, Interactional Purpose, Lower Level, Vyavaharika Level, they are Samsari in Arthur. Samsari. Up to here, we saw in the last class. <laughs> now we'll go to the thirteenth verse, Introduction. Here further um, clarification, Sureshwara Acharya is going to do. Yatha buddha purva yo reva matmani iti ati deshe nam buddhi sadharamya vidhanat nanatva prasaktao tadapamadartha maha. Yatha buddhau. Now, the discussion is further elaborated analysis. What is the problem? Here he says, Apavadartham tad apavadartham aha. To refute, to negate that, thirteenth verse I am going to explain. In thirteenth verse. What is that you are going to refute? If you ask Sureshwara Acharya, he says, What is the problem that you want to refute or negate? Hey Sureshwara Acharya, the problem is lying in hidden in this above sloka, twelfth sloka presentation. There is nothing wrong, but if you do not know, understand properly, there is a problem. If you understand properly, no problem. Suppose you extend that mind 
సెల్ఫ్హుడ్ మైండ్స్ నోవర్హుడ్ కాన్షియస్నెస్ అండ్ ఇట్ ఈస్ సిమిలర్ టు ఆత్మ కాన్షియస్నెస్ అండ్ ఆత్మ సెల్ఫ్హుడ్ బోధృత ప్రత్యక్త ఇఫ్ యూ స్టేక్ దెమ్ అస్ సిమిలర్ దెన్ దెర్ ఈజ్ అ ప్రాబ్లమ్ ఈస్ టెల్లింగ్ మైండ్ ఈజ్ ఎండౌడ్ విత్ మైండ్ ఈజ్ ఎండౌడ్ విత్ వాట్ సెల్ఫ్హుడ్ అండ్ కాన్షియస్నెస్ వాట్ టైప్ ఆఫ్ సెల్ఫ్హుడ్ అండ్ కాన్షియస్నెస్ ఎంపెరికల్ ఎంపెరికల్ మీన్స్ వాట్ వ్యావహారిక వ్యావహారిక మీన్స్ వాట్ మిథ్యా that is changing consciousness changing selfhood then atma is also endowed with absolute selfhood absolute consciousness consciousness and selfhood both are same to mind and atma mind also has got bodhrata pratyakta atma also has got bodhrata pratyakta bodhrata means consciousness pratyakta means selfhood then what is the difference mind is also having selfhood and consciousness atma is also having selfhood and consciousness is there any difference yes there is a difference lot of difference what is the difference by using one word ఎంపెరికల్ వ్యావహారిక బోధృత వ్యావహారిక ప్రత్యక్త ఫర్ ద మైండ్ వీ హ్యావ్ యూజ్డ్ ఫర్ ఆత్మ వాట్ వీ హ్యావ్ యూజ్డ్ పారమార్థిక ప్రత్యక్త పారమార్థిక బోధృత వీ హ్యావ్ యూజ్డ్ సి దట్ పారమార్థిక అబ్జల్యూట్ ఫర్ ఆత్మ వీ హ్యావ్ యూజ్డ్ వ్యావహారిక ఎంపెరికల్ వీ హ్యావ్ యూజ్డ్ ఫర్ ద మైండ్ సో యూ కెన్ నాట్ సే బోత్ ఆర్ సిమిలర్ even though bodhruta pratyakta both two words are used in the for the mind also atma also you cannot equate both of them the problem both of them mind is endowed with consciousness empirical consciousness means changing consciousness changing consciousness means what i said vritti gnana i know this i know that that is called conscious i am conscious of this i am conscious of that that is changing consciousness vritti gnana therefore vyavaharika vritti gnanam vyavaharika selfhood mind atma has got paramarthika bhuktruta repeatedly i am telling the same word so that it will enter in your mind so mind also has got atma also got atma has got absolute paramarthika bodhruta pratyakta so if you understand in this manner no problem it's okay vyavaharika taya for the mind paramarthika taya for atma if you understand wonderful excellent but the question is if you extend ati deshena you see yatha buddhau పూర్వయో ఏం ఆత్మని ఇది అతిదేశేన దిస్ అతిదేశ ఆత్మని ఇది అతిదేశేన ఆత్మనీత్యతిదేశేన జస్టాస్ యథ జస్టాస్ బుద్ధౌ ద మైండ్ ఈజ్ ఎండౌడ్ విత్ పొసెస్ విత్ వాట్ సెల్ఫ్హుడ్ వ్యవహారిక సెల్ఫ్హుడ్ and vyavaharika consciousness buddha purvayo as said in the previous shloka purvayo evam atmani in atma also atma also endowed with absolute consciousness absolute selfhood what is the substance what is the attribute now that is the question substance means dravyam Oops. and um, attribute means property guna when you say mind has got bodhruta pratyakta atma has got bodhruta pratyakta of course 
ಮೈಂಡ್ ಹ್ಯಾಸ್ ಗಾಟ್ ವ್ಯಾವಹಾರಿಕ ಬೋಧೃತ ಪ್ರತ್ಯಕ್ತ ಆತ್ಮ ಹ್ಯಾಸ್ ಗಾಟ್ ಪಾರಮಾರ್ಥಿಕ ಬೋಧೃತ ಪ್ರತ್ಯಕ್ತ ಎಂಡ್ ಔಡ್ ಹೂ ಈಸ್ ವಿಚ್ ಈಸ್ ದ ಸಬ್ಸ್ಟೆಂಡ್ ವಿಚ್ ಈಸ್ ದ ಪ್ರಾಪರ್ಟಿ ದಟ್ ಈಸ್ ದ ಡಿಸ್ಕಷನ್ ಹಿಯರ್ ಇನ್ ದ ಥರ್ಟೀನ್ತ್ ವರ್ಸ್ ಈಸ್ ಗೋಯಿಂಗ್ ಟು ಎಕ್ಸ್ಪ್ಲೈನ್ ವಾಟ್ ಈಸ್ ದ ಸಬ್ಸ್ಟೆನ್ಸ್ ವಾಟ್ ಈಸ್ ದ ಎಟ್ರಿಬ್ಯೂಟ್ ಲೆಟ್ ಅಸ್ ಸಿ ಫಸ್ಟ್ ಮೈಂಡ್ ಹಿ ಸೈನ್ಸ್ ಹಿಯರ್ ಬುದ್ಧಿ ಸಾಧರ್ಮ್ಯ ವಿಧಾನಾತ್ ಬುದ್ಧಿ ಸಾಧರ್ಮ್ಯ ಮೀನ್ಸ್ ಸಾಧರ್ಮ್ಯ ಮೀನ್ಸ್ ಸಿಮಿಲ್ಯಾರಿಟಿ 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 ಮೀನ್ಸ್ ಸಾಧರ್ಮ್ಯ ಎಕ್ಸ್ಟೆನ್ಷನ್ ಆಫ್ ದಟ್ ಸಿಮಿಲ್ಯಾರಿಟಿ ಎಕ್ಸ್ಟೆನ್ಷನ್ ಆಫ್ ರಿಲೇಷನ್ ಲೈಕ್ ಮೈಂಡ್ ಮೈಂಡ್ ಇನ್ ದೈಡ್ ಇಫ್ ಯು ಟೇಕ್ ಲೈಕ್ ದಟ್ ನಾನಾತ್ವ ಪ್ರಸಕ್ತೌನರು ನಾನಾತ್ವ ಪ್ರಸಕ್ತಿ ಮೀನ್ಸ್ ವಾಟ್ ಮೈಂಡ್ ಹ್ಯಾಸ್ ಗಾಟ್ ಕಾನ್ಷಿಯಸ್ನೆಸ್ ಮೈಂಡ್ ಹ್ಯಾಸ್ ಗಾಟ್ ಸೆಲ್ಫ್ಹುಡ್ ಸೊ ಹೌ ಮೆನಿ ಆರ್ ದೇರ್ ನಾನಾತ್ವ ಮೀನ್ಸ್ ಪ್ಲೂರ್ಯಾಲಿಟಿ ಮೈಂಡ್ ಈಸ್ ಒನ್ ಮೈಂಡ್ ಈಸ್ ದ ಸಬ್ಸ್ಟೆನ್ಸ್ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ಇಟ್ ಹ್ಯಾಸ್ ಗಾಟ್ ಎ ಪ್ರಾಪರ್ಟಿ ಕಾಲ್ಡ್ ಪ್ರತ್ಯಕ್ತ ಒನ್ ಪ್ರಾಪರ್ಟಿ ಸೆಲ್ಫ್ಹುಡ್ ದೆನ್ ಬೋಧೃತ ಕಾನ್ಷಿಯಸ್ನೆಸ್ ಥರ್ಡ್ ಒನ್ ಮೈಂಡ್ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ಟು ಎಟ್ರಿಬ್ಯೂಟ್ಸ್ ಒನ್ ಸಬ್ಸ್ಟೆನ್ಸ್ ಟು ಎಟ್ರಿಬ್ಯೂಟ್ಸ್ ಟೋಟಲಿ ಹೌ ಮೆನಿ ತ್ರೀ ದಟ್ ಮೀನ್ಸ್ ಪ್ಲೂರ್ಯಾಲಿಟಿ ದಟ್ ಮೀನ್ಸ್ ದ್ವೈತಂ ಸೊ ನಾನಾತ್ವ ಪ್ರಸಕ್ತವು ವಿತ್ ರಿಗಾರ್ಡ್ ಟು ದ ಮೈಂಡ್ ದೆರ್ ಈಸ್ ಎ ಪಾಸಿಬಿಲಿಟಿ ಆಫ್ ಬಹುತ್ವ ಮೈಂಡ್ ಹ್ಯಾಸ್ ಗಾಟ್ ವ್ಯಾವಹಾರಿಕ ಬೋಧೃತ ಪ್ರತ್ಯಕ್ತ ದೇರ್ ಫೋರ್ ಮೈಂಡ್ ಈಸ್ ದ ಸಬ್ಸ್ಟೆನ್ಸ್ ಪ್ರತ್ಯಕ್ತ ಅಂಡ್ ಬೋಧೃತ ಆರ್ ಕಮ್ ಅಂಡ್ ಆರ್ ಟೂ ಪ್ರಾಪರ್ಟೀಸ್ ದೆರ್ ಈಸ್ ಎ ದ್ವೈತಂ ನಾನಾತ್ವ ಪ್ರಸಕ್ತವು ವೆನ್ ಇಟ್ ಈಸ್ ಸೋ ದ ಟೀಚಿಂಗ್ ಈಸ್ ಗಿವೆನ್ ಸಪೋಸ್ ಸಿಮಿಲರ್ಲಿ ಇಫ್ ಯು ಎಕ್ಸ್ಟೆಂಡ್ ದಿಸ್ ಅತಿದೇಶೇನ ಆತ್ಮನಿ ನೋ ಇಫ್ ಯು ಎಕ್ಸ್ಟೆಂಡ್ ದಿಸ್ ಲೈಕ್ ಮೈಂಡ್ ಹ್ಯಾಸ್ ಗಾಟ್ ಟೂ ಪ್ರಾಪರ್ಟೀಸ್ ಮೈಂಡ್ ಈಸ್ ದ ಸಬ್ಸ್ಟೆನ್ಸ್ ಟ್ರೂ ಪ್ರಾಪರ್ಟೀಸ್ ಆರ್ ದೇರ್ ದೇರ್ ಫಾರ್ ದ್ವೈತಂ ಲೆಟ್ ಕ್ಯಾನ್ ಯು ಟೇಕ್ ಲೈಕ್ ದಟ್ ಫಾರ್ ಆತ್ಮ ಆಲ್ಸೋ ಅತಿದೇಶೇನ ಆತ್ಮನಿ ಎಕ್ಸ್ಟೆಂಡಿಂಗ್ ದಿಸ್ ಸೇಮ್ ಟು ದ ಆತ್ಮ ವಾಟ್ ವಿಲ್ ಹ್ಯಾಪನ್ ಆತ್ಮ ಈಸ್ ಎಂಡೌಡ್ ವಿತ್ ಪಾರಮಾರ್ಥಿಕ ಪ್ರತ್ಯಕ್ತ ಪಾರಮಾರ್ಥಿಕ ಬೋಧೃತ ದೆನ್ ಆತ್ಮ ಈಸ್ ಒನ್ ಪ್ರತ್ಯಕ್ತ ಪಾರಮಾರ್ಥಿಕ ಪ್ರತ್ಯಕ್ತ ಈಸ್ ನಂಬರ್ ಟು ಪ್ರಾಪರ್ಟಿ ನಂಬರ್ ಒನ್ ಪಾರಮಾರ್ಥಿಕ ಬೋಧೃತ ಪ್ರಾಪರ್ಟಿ ನಂಬರ್ ಟು ಸೊ ಒನ್ ಸಬ್ಸ್ಟೆನ್ಸ್ ಆತ್ಮ ಟು ಪ್ರಾಪರ್ಟೀಸ್ ಆಫ್ ಆತ್ಮ ಪಾರಮಾರ್ಥಿಕ ಬೋಧೃತ ಪ್ರತ್ಯಕ್ತ ಟು ಪ್ರಾಪರ್ಟೀಸ್ ನಾನಾತ್ವ ವಿಲ್ ಕಮ್ ಅತಿದೇಶೇನ ಎಕ್ಸ್ಟೆಂಡಿಂಗ್ ದ ಸೇಮ್ ಎಕ್ಸಾಂಪಲ್ ಆಫ್ ದ ಮೈಂಡ್ ಪ್ರತ್ಯಕ್ತ ಬೋಧೃಟ ಟು ದ ಆತ್ಮ ಆಲ್ಸೋ ನೋ ಲುಕ್ ಇನ್ ಟು ದ ಲೈನ್ ಯಥಾ ಬುದ್ಧೌ ಪೂರ್ವಯೋ ಏವಂ ಜಸ್ಟ್ ಆಸ್ ಸೆಡ್ ಅಬೌ ದ ಶ್ಲೋಕ ಬೋಧೃತ ಬುದ್ಧೇ ಬೋಧೃತ ಪ್ರತ್ಯಕ್ತ ಆರ್ ಕರ್ತೃತ ಸೆಡ್ ಟು ದ ಮೈಂಡ್ ಆತ್ಮನಿ ಇತಿ ಅತಿದೇಶೇನ ಇನ್ ಆತ್ಮ ಆಲ್ಸೋ ಐ ವಾಂಟ್ ಟು ಎಕ್ಸ್ಟೆಂಡ್ ದಿಸ್ ನ ಅಪ ಪ್ರಾಬ್ಲಮ್ ನಾನಾತ್ವ ಪ್ರಾಬ್ಲಮ್ ದಟ್ ಈಸ್ ಪ್ರಾಬ್ಲಮ್ ಥ್ರೂ ಕಂಪ್ಯಾರಿಸನ್ ಸಾಧರ್ಮ್ಯ ಸಾಧರ್ಮ್ಯಾತ್ ಸಾಧರ್ಮ್ಯ ವಿಧಾನಾತ್ ಸಾಧರ್ಮ್ಯ ವಿಧಾನ ಮೀನ್ಸ್ ಅತಿದೇಶೇನ ಬುದ್ಧಿ ಸಾಧರ್ಮ್ಯ ವಿಧಾನ ಮೀನ್ಸ್ ಎಕ್ಸ್ಟೆನ್ಷನ್ ಥ್ರೂ ದ ಕಂಪ್ಯಾರಿಸನ್ ಎಕ್ಸ್ಟೆನ್ಷನ್ ಆಫ್ ದ ಕಂಪ್ಯಾರಿಸನ್ ವಿತ್ ದ ಮೈಂಡ್ ಕಂಪ್ಯಾರಿಸನ್ ಆಫ್ ವಾಟ್ ಕಂಪ್ಯಾರಿಸನ್ ಆಫ್ ಆತ್ಮ ಕಂಪ್ಯಾರಿಸನ್ 
ನಾವು ತರ್ಕಶಾಸ್ತ್ರ ಅಕಾರ್ಡಿಂಗ್ ಟು ತರ್ಕಶಾಸ್ತ್ರ ಬಿಫೋರ್ ಕಮಿಂಗ್ ಟು ವೇದಾಂತ ಸ್ಟಡಿ ಒನ್ ಹ್ಯಾಸ್ ಟು ಸ್ಟಡಿ ವೇ ತರ್ಕಶಾಸ್ತ್ರ ವ್ಯಾಕರಣಶಾಸ್ತ್ರ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ಮೀಮಾಂಸಾ ಶಾಸ್ತ್ರ ಒನ್ ಹ್ಯಾಸ್ ಟು ಸ್ಟಡಿ ಡೋಂಟ್ ಆಸ್ಕ್ ಮೀ ಸ್ವಾಮಿನಿ ವಿ ಹ್ಯಾವ್ ನಾಟ್ ಸ್ಟಡೀಡ್ ತರ್ಕ ವ್ಯಾಕರಣ ಮೀಮಾಂಸ ಅಂಡ್ ನಾರ್ಮಲ್ಲಿ ಇನ್ ಸಂಪ್ರದಾಯ ಪೀಪಲ್ ವೆನ್ ದೇ ಸ್ಟಡಿ ಶಾಸ್ತ್ರ ಟು ಟೀಚ್ ಟು ಅದರ್ಸ್ ದೇ ಸ್ಟಡಿ ಸೊ ತರ್ಕ ಮೀಮಾಂಸ ವ್ಯಾಕರಣ ಸೊ ದಿ ತರ್ಕಶಾಸ್ತ್ರಿ ಸೇಸ್ ಲೊಜಿಷಿಯಂ ಸೇಸ್ ಆತ್ಮ ಈಸ್ ಆಲ್ಸೋ ಎ ದ್ರವ್ಯಂ ಅಕಾರ್ಡಿಂಗ್ ಟು ಹಿಮ್ ಆತ್ಮ ಹ್ಯಾಸ್ ಗಾಟ್ ಪ್ರಾಪರ್ಟೀಸ್ ಆತ್ಮ ಈಸ್ ಎ ದ್ರವ್ಯಂ ಇನ್ ಇಟ್ ಹ್ಯಾಸ್ ಗಾಟ್ ಗುಣ ಕರ್ಮ ಕ್ರಿಯಾ ಲಾಟ್ ಆಫ್ ಪ್ರಾಪರ್ಟೀಸ್ ಅಕಾರ್ಡಿಂಗ್ ಟು ತರ್ಕಶಾಸ್ತ್ರ ದಟ್ ಈಸ್ ವಾಟ್ ಹಿ ಈಸ್ ಗೋಯಿಂಗ್ ಟು ನೆಗೇಟ್ ವಿತ್ ರಿಗಾರ್ಡ್ ಟು ಆತ್ಮ ದಟ್ಸ್ ವೈ ಇನ್ ವಿಶಿಷ್ಟಾದ್ವೈತ ವಿನ್ ವಿ ಸೇ ನಿರ್ಗುಣ ಆತ್ಮ ದೇ ಸೇ ಆತ್ಮ ನಿರ್ಗುಣ ಮೀನ್ಸ್ ವಾಟ್ ನಿರ್ಗತ ದುಷ್ಟಗುಣ ಯಸ್ಮತ್ ತಸ್ಮತ್ ಆತ್ಮ ನಿರ್ಗುಣ ವಿಶಿಷ್ಟಾದ್ವೈತಿ ಸೇಸ್ ನಿರ್ಗುಣ ಮೀನ್ಸ್ ನಾಟ್ ಅಟ್ರಿಬ್ಯೂಟ್ಲೆಸ್ ಅಕಾರ್ಡಿಂಗ್ ಟು ದೆಮ್ ಅಕಾರ್ಡಿಂಗ್ ಟು ದೆಮ್ ಬ್ಯಾಡ್ ಅಟ್ರಿಬ್ಯೂಟ್ಸ್ ಆರ್ ನಾಟ್ ದೇರ್ ಸಕಲ ಕಲ್ಯಾಣ ಗುಣಗಣೈಕ ನಿಲಯ ಪರಮಾತ್ಮ ವಿಶಿಷ್ಟಾದ್ವೈತಿ ಸೇಸ್ ದಟ್ ಈಸ್ ದ ಡಿಫರೆನ್ಸ್ ದೇ ಆಲ್ಸೋ ಸೇ ನಿರ್ಗುಣ ಭಗವಾನ್ ಈಸ್ ನಿರ್ಗುಣ ಮೀನ್ಸ್ ವಾಟ್ ದುಷ್ಟಗುಣ ಸಾರ್ ನಾಟ್ ದೇರ್ ನಿರ್ಗು ನಿರ್ಗತ ದುಷ್ಟಗುಣ ಯಸ್ಮತ್ ಫ್ರಮ್ ಹುಚ್ ಹಿ ಲಾಡ್ ದುಷ್ಟಗುಣ ಸಾರ್ ಗಾನ್ ಹೀ ಈಸ್ ಕಾಲ್ ನಿರ್ಗುಣ ಕಲ್ಯಾಣ ಗುಣ ಸಾರ್ ದೇರ್ ಅಕಾರ್ಡಿಂಗ್ ಟು ಅದ್ವೈತಿ ಈವೆನ್ ದೇರ್ ಇಸ್ ನೋ ಸಕಲ ಕಲ್ಯಾಣ ಗುಣ ಆಲ್ಸೋ ಅಕಾರ್ಡಿಂಗ್ ಟು ಅದ್ವೈತಿ ವೆರಿ ಡಿಫಿಕಲ್ಟ್ ಫಾರ್ ಪೀಪಲ್ ಟು ಸ್ವಾಲೋ ದೇರ್ ಫಾರ್ ಆತ್ಮ ಈಸ್ ದ ಸಬ್ಸ್ಟೆನ್ಸ್ ಕಾನ್ಶಿಯಸ್ನೆಸ್ ಈಸ್ ಐ ಪ್ರಾಪರ್ಟಿ ಆರ್ ಎಟ್ರಿಬ್ಯೂಟ್ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ಸೆಲ್ಫ್ ಹುಡ್ ಈಸ್ ಎಟ್ರಿಬ್ಯೂಟ್ ಇಫ್ ಯು ಟೇಕ್ ಕಾನ್ಶಿಯಸ್ನೆಸ್ ಈಸ್ ಸಬ್ಸ್ಟೆನ್ಸ್ ಆರ್ ಎಟ್ರಿಬ್ಯೂಟ್ ಇಫ್ ಯು ಟೇಕ್ ಕಾನ್ಶಿಯಸ್ನೆಸ್ ಈಸ್ ಸಬ್ಸ್ಟೆಂಟ್ ಆತ್ಮ ಈಸ್ ದ ಪ್ರಾಪರ್ಟಿ ಇಫ್ ಯು ಟೇಕ್ ಆತ್ಮ ಈಸ್ ದ ಸಬ್ಸ್ಟೆನ್ಸ್ ಕಾನ್ಶಿಯಸ್ನೆಸ್ ಬಿಕಮ್ ಪ್ರಾಪರ್ಟಿ ಸೊ ದೇರ್ ಫಾರ್ ಯು ಕೆನಾಟ್ ಸೇ ಆತ್ಮ ಈಸ್ ಎ ಸಬ್ಸ್ಟೆನ್ಸ್ ಟು ಅಪವಾದ ಅರ್ಥಮಾಹ ಟು ನೆಗೇಟ್ ದಟ್ ಪ್ರಾಬ್ಲಮ್ ಆಫ್ ಸಬ್ಸ್ಟೆನ್ಶಿಯ ಸಬ್ಸ್ಟ್ಯಾನ್ಶಿಯಾಲಿಟಿ ಸಬ್ಸ್ಟ್ಯಾನ್ಶಿಯಾಲಿಟಿ ವೇರೆ ಮೀನಿಂಗ್ ಅಧಿಷ್ಠಾನ ಸಬ್ಸ್ಟೆನ್ಸ್ ಮೀನ್ಸ್ ದ್ರವ್ಯತ್ವ consciousness as attribute or consciousness as substance is not acceptable so dharma ashraya when dharma means a property dharma ashraya dravya dravya is that substance is that in which properties are there or property is that which abide in the dravya substance this is tarka language okay substance is that where attribute is residing dravya is that where the attribute is residing dharma ashraya dravya in tarka shastra attribute attributes are divided into jati one type of attribute karma is another type of attribute according to tarka shastra and um, um, guna is another type of attribute kriya is another type of attribute therefore substance is the locus of all attributes guna jati kriya various attributes are there in the dravya substance is always having one or other attribute substance is always having one or the other attribute so therefore dravyam is always sagunam why always having properties dravyam is always sagunam if you accept atma as dravyam it must have guna dravyashraya guna guna is always one or the other guna will be there yatra yatra dravyatvam tatra tatra sagunatvam yatra yatra dravyatva means wherever substance is there 
in that substance there will be guna saguna propertied propertied substance propertied substance atma can never be the uh, defined as substance according to advaita vedanta but tarka shastri takes atma as a dravyam substance and uh, if it is a substance atma will become sagunaha correct if you accept atma as a substance it must have some gunas okay we'll take consciousness as guna pratyekta self would as also guna if anyone says no we can never accept atma as dravyam substance having properties like consciousness and selfhood why consciousness is not a property of atma why atma and conscious are synonyms atma is consciousness consciousness is atma how dravya guna sambandha how relation can come in one entity therefore dravya guna sambandha you cannot talk with regard to atma therefore apavadartham i want suresh rajara says i want to negate if anybody want to show the similarity between mind attributes pratyekta and bodhrata and atma attributes of pratyekta and bodhrata i don't accept apavadartham for the negation of that similarity when similarity takes a nanatma prasakta plurality will come plurality should not come in atma atma is sajati avijati svagata bheda rahitaha atma doesn't have any internal differences external differences therefore what is the significance of attributes and property all attributes why we are so Uh, vehement atma is attributeless we are telling why can't we take consciousness as attribute of atma because we don't take atma become the substance dravyam consciousness become attribute consciousness drav guna if it you take it is always dependent upon atma atma is the substance it will have saguna whatever is sagunam will undergo a change modification therefore atmanah nirvikaratvam will be in trouble atmanah advaitam ekatvam is also in trouble then for atma is there consciousness property is there pratyekta self food property is there suppose you say advaitam goes away dvaitam will come nirvikara um, atma status will go away savikaritvam will come atma will become paratantram consciousness chaitanyam will become paratantram because property consciousness can never exist independent of dravya substance suppose you take atma consciousness as property property doesn't exist independently without substance substance is always having property atma nirgunah will be in trouble or ruled out <laughs> nirgunatvam of atma will be in trouble and that ekatva atma advaita atma will be in trouble therefore atma as substance is not acceptable consciousness as property of atma is not acceptable if you accept all those doshas will come in atma sagunatvam paratantram ashritatvam all will come svatantrata will go according to vedanta upanishads atma is svatantrah nityah it is nirguna if you accept atma has got properties of absolute consciousness one property absolute selfhood is another property na? 
నిత్యత్వం అఫ్ ఆత్మ విల్ గో అవే ద్రవ్యం ఆల్వేస్ హ్యావ్ ప్రాపర్టీ సగుణత్వం విల్ కమ్ నిర్వీక సవికారత్వం విల్ కమ్ ఆశ్రితత్వం స్వతంత్రత విల్ గో అవే పరతంత్రత్వం విల్ కమ్ ఆల్ ఆర్ ప్రాబ్లమ్స్ ఇఫ్ యూ సే కాన్షియస్నెస్ ఈజ్ అన్ ఎట్రిబ్యూట్ ఆఫ్ ఆత్మ ఇట్ విల్ బికమ్ అండ్ డిపెండెంట్ ఎంటిటీ దట్ ఈస్ వై ఉపనిషత్ సేస్ కాన్షియస్నెస్ ఈజ్ ఇండిపెండెంట్ ఆత్మ ఈజ్ ఇండిపెండెంట్ ఆత్మ అండ్ కాన్షియస్ ఆర్ నాన్ సపరేట్ దేర్ ఫోర్ కాన్షియస్నెస్ కెనాట్ బి టేకెన్ యాజ్ అన్ ఎట్రిబ్యూట్ ఆత్మ కెనాట్ బి టేకెన్ యాజ్ ఎ సబ్స్టెన్స్ వెరీ వెరీ ఇంపార్టెంట్ పోర్షన్ సో ధర్మ ధర్మి సంబంధ ఈజ్ నాట్ దేర్ నౌ విల్ గో టు ద శ్లోక ధర్మ ధర్మి సోపి నైవాత్మనాయత ప్రత్యజ్యోతిరతో భిన్నం భేదహేతోరసంభవాత్ సో దట్ ఇంట్రడక్షన్ ఈస్ ఫర్ దిస్ శ్లోక హౌ ఐఎమ్ గోయింగ్ టు రిజాల్వ్ శంక్ సురేశ్వరాచార్య సేస్ వెన్ ఐ సే mind is endowed with selfhood mind is endowed with consciousness there is a substance attribute relationship mind is the substance changing consciousness bodhruta is an attribute of the mind and pratyakta selfhood వ్యావహారిక సెల్ఫ్ హుడ్ ఆఫ్ ద మైండ్ ఈజ్ ఏ ప్రాపర్టీ వెన్ ఐ సే మైండ్ హ్యాస్ గాట్ టూ ప్రాపర్టీస్ ఇన్ విత్ రిగార్డ్ టు ద మైండ్ ఇట్ ఈస్ ఫైన్ ధర్మ ధర్మిత్వ ధర్మ మీన్స్ ప్రాపర్టీ ధర్మీ మీన్స్ దట్ హుచ్ హ్యాస్ గాట్ ప్రాపర్టీ ధర్మీ మీన్స్ ప్రాపర్టీడ్ వన్ మైండ్ అస్యాహ asyaha means of that mind of that mind there is dharma dharmitva relation because dharma is different from dharmi <coughs> dharmi is different from dharma dharmi means a substance substance is not property property is not substance dvaitam has come with regard to the mind doesn't matter ఇట్స్ ఓకే సో ధర్మిత్వం భేద ధర్మ అండ్ ధర్మిత్వం ధర్మ మీన్స్ ప్రాపర్టీ ఆర్ ఎట్రిబ్యూట్ ధర్మే మీన్స్ ప్రాపర్టీడ్ వన్ హుచ్ హ్యాస్ గాట్ ఎట్రిబ్యూట్ ఈస్ కాల్డ్ ధర్మీ హూ ఈస్ ధర్మీ హియర్ మైండ్ మైండ్ ఈజ్ ద ధర్మీ సబ్స్టెన్స్ అనదర్ నేమ్ ఆఫ్ ధర్మీ ఈజ్ వాట్ సబ్స్టెన్స్ ధర్మ అసే అస్తి ఇది ధర్మీ that which has got dharma what dharma empirical consciousness is one dharma empirical selfhood is another dharma therefore mind comes under dharmi asyaha dharma dharmitva vedaha is the it is possible sahach api naiva atmana they are not possible with regarding to the atma atma possessing selfhood atma is the possessor of consciousness possessor means attribute once it possesses means what attribute atma possess selfhood atma possess consciousness atma is the substance atma has got consciousness property selfhood property na plurality will come it is not supposed to come asyaha means in the case of the mind anyatra dharma tanyatra dharma katopanishad mantra visishta advaiti presents anyatra dharma tanyatra dharma means atma doesn't have paramatma doesn't have dushta gunas and they translate there so we have taking we have taken here as 
दट हेतु सेकेंड लाइन यू सी प्रत्येक ज्योति अतः सेकेंड फस्ट लाइन सेकेंड हाफ इज वाट नैव आत्मना आत्मना संभव सह अभी सह अभी मैंड हेज गाट अस्थि यू हेव टू सप्लै अस्या धर्मधर्मीद अस्या अस्थि फॉर द मैंड देर इज धर्मधर्मीद सब्सटेन्स प्रॉपर्टी भेद इज देर दट भेद इज नाट देर आत्मना नैव संभवती फॉर आत्मा इट नेवर हैपन विथ रिगार्ड आत्मा इट कैन नेवर हैपन सह भेद मीन्स दट सब्सटेन्स एट्रिब्यूट रिलेशनशिप सह भेद सह अभी मीन्स वाट सह भेद अभी दट सब्सटेन्स एट्रिब्यूट रिलेशनशिप और सब्सटेन्स एट्रिब्यूट डिविजन नाट देर फॉर आत्मा आत्मना नैव संभव नईवात्मना आत्मन न संभव न एव मीन न संभव वाट इज नाट संभव आत्मा कैन नाट हेव द कॉन्शियने एज इट्स सब्सटेन इट्स प्रॉपर्टी ईवन कॉन्शियने आलसो कैन नाट बिकम दबस्टेन आत्मा इज द प्रॉपर्टी ऑफ कॉन्शियने यू कैन नाट से Either way, it is wrong only. So, naiva sambhavati yataha. Therefore, because of this reason, what reason? Dharma dharmitva sambandha is possible in the mind because there vyavaharika pratyakta, vyavaharika bodhruta, mind substance status is okay for the mind, but. आत्मा इज नाट लाइक दैट आत्मा इज एक मैंड्स आर मेनी मैंड इज सविकारी मैंड इज द सब्सटेन्स इन हुच ऑल प्रॉपर्टीज आर देर इच्छा द्वेष सुख दुख संघात चेतना धृति एक क्षेत्र इन भगवद्गीता विशा ऑल दीज आर इन द मैंड बट यू कैन नाट से दे आर ऑल लाइक इन द आत्मा Upanishad is not accepting that. Hmm? So Atma is uh, in Atma, Atma na ha. For Atma to that Atma, they are not possible. Na sambhavati. Why they are not possible? Second line. Pratyak jyoti hi ataha abhinna ha. Bheda ha. Printing is not very clear. यू हेव टू सी प्रत्यक ज्योति ही अतः अभिन्नम प्रत्यक ज्योति ही मीन्स हियर डोंट टेक लिटरली प्रत्यक इन्नर ज्योति ही मीन्स लाइट इन्नर लाइट इफ यू टेक लिटरली इट इज प्रॉब्लम देर इज इन्नर लाइट आलरे पीपल आर टेकिंग लिटरली एंड डूइंग मेडिटेशन इन्नर लाइट देर इज लाइट इज मूविंग इन सैड नो लाइट कैन मूव इन सैड इट इज नाट पॉसिबल ओके ओनली ब्रैकेट विद कैन पुट इन विद इन ब्रैकेट्स व्हाट इज दैट प्रत्येक ज्योति ही दैट इन्नर लाइट लाइक आत्मा इन्नर लाइट देर अतः मींस देर फोर यतः सिंस आत्मन धर्मधर्मित्व संबंध न संभवति यतः अतः सिंस यतः मीन्स सिंस इन आत्मा देर इज नो एनी सब्सटेन्स प्रॉपर्टी रिलेशन इज पॉसिबल लाइक माइंड देर फोर अतः देर फोर प्रत्येक ज्योति ही देर फोर द इन्नर लाइट व्हाट इज द इन्नर लाइट साक्षी चैतन्य द साक्षी चैतन्य ज्योति ही अतः अभिन्न ज्योति मीन्स कॉन्शियने इन्नर लाइट मीन्स कॉन्शियने दट आत्मा साक्षिचैतन्य दट कॉन्शियने आर् अभिन्न 
Abhinam means divisionless, uh, differenceless, divisionless, differenceless, free from difference. Bheda hetuhu asambhavad. Bheda hetu, hetu means a reason. Reason uh, to have attributes. Reason to have attribute. Hetu, reason to establish the substance and attribute relationship in Atma. That Hetu. To establish the relationship, there must be substance, property, both must be there. That Hetu must be there. That condition must be there. What condition? One must be substance, another must be uh, property. Mind is the substance, consciousness, changing consciousness, vritti jnanam is the property of the mind. So there it is possible that relation, dharma, dharmitva, relation possible because they are vyavaharikam. But in atma, the absolute consciousness cannot be the property of the Atma because Atma is Consciousness. Consciousness is Atma. There is no relationship between one. Sambandaha <laughs> dhikotikaha. Minimum two must be there to have relation. Since Consciousness is not separate from Atma, since Atma is Chaitanyam, Chaitanyam is Atma, how can you talk about relation? Hetu who is not there. Condition to establish the division, relationship to, to establish the relationship between Atma and Consciousness, there is no condition at all. You cannot establish that Consciousness as attribute, Atma as substance, you cannot establish. Why? relationship between Sakshi and Consciousness is impossible. Asambhavat Asambhavat means impossible. What is impossible? The relationship between Atma and Consciousness is impossible. Why impossible? Because uh, pratyak Jyotihi Ataha Abhinnam. <laughs> that is the reason you have to understand. Why that is Hetu is not there for Atma to establish as Dravyam and uh, Chaitanyam as Consciousness as property. Na? Both are Abhinnam. Both are non-separate. Both are uh, uh, one and the same. Abhinna means there is no bhinnata, there is no bhedaha. That means what? Pratyak Jyotihi, the consciousness, is the same as Atma. Pratyak Jyotihi Ataha Abhinnam. Therefore, Atma, Pratyak Jyotihi, the Sakshi Chaitanyam, is different, non-different from non-different from the Chaitanyam. Sakshi Chaitanyam is Atma. Consciousness is Atma. There is no difference. Both are one and the same. Two names, that's all. There is no difference. Beautiful verse. Excellent verse. So therefore, the world is the substance. Separate from Atma, you can say. The world is attribute separate from Atma, you can say. If you say separate, it is Dvaitam. Really speaking, temporarily we say world is there, Atma is there. Dvaitam only. But we negate the world later. Mithya world is as good as non-existent. Okay. Essence of this 13th sloka is this. Okay. What is that essence? Na? Don't extend the relation to Atma and Consciousness, Selfhood, as taken in the mind case. With regard to mind, you have taken relationship. 
அங்கே ஓகே இங்கே ஓகே இல்லை என்ன இங்கே என்ன ஆத்மா அங்கே என்ன மைண்டு ஓகே இஃப் யூ டேக் இட் தென் வேர்ல்ட் இஸ் தேர் சப்ஸ்டென்ஸ் the world is the substance if you say separate from free atma world is substance separate from consciousness or attribute world is the substance world is substance separate from atma world is the attribute separate from atma dvaitam will come and the problem illa enna so world attribute uh, if you say world is the attribute of atma you become vishishta dvaiti world become the attribute of atma if you say you become a vishishta advaiti we say world is neither uh, substance nor attribute of atma na nirodho na chotpatti there is no world at all world is a word on the lip vacharam bhanam vikaro namadheyam uh, ஆத்மா ஏவ சத்தியம் ந நிரோத ந உற்பத்தி நான் ஜுவல் ஐ தி பிரம்மன் அலோன் பிரபஞ்சோபம் சாந்தம் சிவம் அத்வைதம் சதுர்த்தம் மன்யந்தே ச ஆத்மா ச விக்னேய வேர்ல்ட் இஸ் தேர் வேர்ல்ட் எங்க இருக்கு என்ன எக்ஸ்பீரியன்ஷியலி தேர் பட் நாட் கவுண்டபிள் ஆஸ் எ ப்ராப்பர்ட்டி ஆஸ் எ சப்ஸ்டன்ஸ் ஆஃப் ஆத்மா யூ கேன் நாட் டாக் அபவுட் world and atma i am there world is there na mm-hmm. world is vyavaharikam mithya empirical empirical cannot be counted according to tarka shastra atma is a substance avani kirkala namak kadiyad so mind is inert substance consciousness is the attribute of the mind but atma is not inert atma is ever sentient since mind is inert it needs consciousness attribute to make the mind sentient and the mind vishayathlo okay pa atma vishayathlo not okay yeah na atma is self uh, effulgent it is naturally sentient conscious cannot be the attribute of atma because atma is consciousness it doesn't require any property like consciousness because it is already conscious entity conscious of the mind is an attribute of the mind consciousness of the atma is not the attribute of the atma it is the nature of atma what is the final conclusion consciousness is the property what type of consciousness changing consciousness vritti gnanam that consciousness is an attribute of the mind because mind is inert therefore mind can be the substance consciousness can be the uh, attribute of the mind fine but consciousness cannot be the attribute of the atma because atma is already consciousness that's why it doesn't require the attribute of consciousness so consciousness is atma atma is consciousness fine that is what he says here i mean asambhavat impossible with this i conclude 13th verse beautiful wonderful excellent verse let us go to 14th introduction small introduction bheda hitva sambhavam darshayan naha aha again sureshwara acharya further want to clarify darshayan to show why there could be no uh, ground for difference you are telling consciousness atma there is no difference you are telling why ಭೇದ ಹೇತ್ ಅಸಂಭವ ನ ಅಸಂಭವಾತ್ ಹಿ ಸೆಡ್ ವೈ ದಟ್ ಅಸಂಭವ ವೈ ದ ಇಂಪಾಸಿಬಿಲಿಟಿ ವೈ ದರ್ ಈಸ್ ಎನ್ ಇಂಪಾಸಿಬಿಲಿಟಿ ಆಫ್ ದಟ್ ಸಬ್ಸ್ಟೆನ್ಸ್ ಎಟ್ರಿಬ್ಯೂಟ್ ರಿಲೇಷನ್ಶಿಪ್ ಬಿಟ್ವೀನ್ ಆತ್ಮ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ಕಾನ್ಶಿಯಸ್ನೆಸ್ ದಟ್ ಭೇದ ಹೇತು ಹೇತು ಈಸ್ ನಾಟ್ ದೇರ್ ಕಂಡೀಷನ್ ಈಸ್ ನಾಟ್ ದೇರ್ 
to establish the bheda between consciousness and atma why what is the reason why there could be no ground for differentiation is brought out aha is brought out where in 14th verse which we will read in the next class Om Purnamada Purnamidam Purnat Purnamudachate Purnasya Purnamadaya Purnameva Vasishyate Om Shanti 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 Harihi Om Shri Guru Bhyo Namaha Harihi Om